All right, let me introduce you to Fedora. Fedora is a relatively new website that allows anyone to build their own online school, and it's remarkably similar to Udemy in both layout and function. And I believe that Fedora is about to revolutionize the world of internet marketing. Fedora and online schools just like it that might pop up soon are going to revolutionize online marketing because they online school the world of information products. In other words, they turn the information products world from kind of a cheap download to a really professionally presented online training. And if you know anything about online training, it's going through the roof right now. Udemy is exploding like crazy. Other massive online, open online courses are exploding through the roof. Uh, it is a massive mega trend as more and more people work to improve their skills, to improve their work skills and their job opportunities. They are going into retraining, but they're not going in the traditional way like technical schools or colleges or local community colleges. They're going online to learn all the skills they need. And Fedora and companies like it are going to completely revolutionize the education world and especially the online marketing and the digital information products world. But Fedora is different from Udemy in that they don't do any marketing of your courses. You have to do your marketing yourself. However, if you already have an audience, like an email list or a fan base, or if you know how to get your own traffic, then Fedora becomes an exciting option for you. And by the way, towards the end of this course, I'm going to show you several ways to get your own traffic so you don't have to rely on Udemy to bring you the sales. Let's look at some of the benefits of Fedora. Number one, you own your content. That means you can place it not just on Fedora, but you can place it on Udemy or other websites. Now, if we're talking about private label rights, resale rights, or master resale rights content, you cannot put that content on Udemy. You want to be sure that you only keep it on Fedora. And this is one of the reasons that I'm excited about this, is Fedora does not have that same restriction that Udemy has. Uh, Udemy does not want people posting private label rights content because then you'll have multiple instructors that have the same course you know, on the site. That doesn't make any sense. But on Fedora, you can put private label rights content to your heart's content. And now you have a super easy delivery system for your content. Next, it's super easy to upload and publish courses on Fedora. Super, super simple. And I'm going to walk you through that process in this course. Next, you own your own standalone online school with its own URL. So you can literally send people right to your school or right to that particular course landing page directly. And it's really well laid out, very professional look and feel to it. Here's a really big benefit. You can offer your courses for free. You can offer paid courses and you can offer recurring billing, meaning like a membership site. Let's say that you wanted to package a bunch of private label rights courses into one big membership site. Let's say you have a hard drive full of PLR products that have just been gathering dust. You could instantly create your own membership site by uploading these into their own courses and then bundling all those courses in one big package deal and then offering monthly recurring billing or monthly uh, payment to access all of those courses in one shot. So you could literally build a passive income from your private label rights courses. Now, as long as you have a really good uh, theme to your courses. You don't just have kind of a mishmash them all around and have all different kinds of courses, but as long as you have all of the same similar related courses, you should have a pretty good membership site. If you add in maybe a weekly webinar or a how-to webinar or a, or a support webinar of some kind or teleconference, now you're adding even more value so that people stay paying that monthly billing. So this is very exciting and I'm going to be doing this myself is creating a membership site with many of my own courses plus other additional related courses. Next, you don't need to buy hosting. You don't need to buy a domain name. You don't need to install WordPress. You don't need to know a thing about setting up a website. And you don't have to spend any money on any of those things. This is huge because in my opinion, one of the reasons that people don't 
publish their private label rights content that they buy is this fact right here. They either don't know how or don't want to or can't afford to get the hosting, the domain name, and the website done. Whether it's doing it themselves or having someone do it for them, it's a hurdle that many people can't get over. That problem is solved with Fedora. You don't have to worry about any of that stuff. It's a self-hosted online school. All you do is upload your, your courses to this school and you're done. It's really, really awesome. Here's a really great benefit. You can set up an affiliate program and pay affiliates to promote your courses or your membership site. Imagine that. You put together a really amazing membership site and then you add an affiliate program to it and you start promoting it to affiliates who can promote it to their audiences in exchange for a commission. Here's one I really like, especially because I often have WSOs, Warrior Special Offers, and I often get refund requests. And some of the refund requests I get are annoyingly silly. Uh, sometimes people say, oh, this isn't what I thought it was. Uh, I'm sorry, can you please refund me? And, and sometimes I get these requests on the same day or even within the same hour that they ordered it. They're not saying that my course is bad and they're not saying that my course doesn't deliver what I said it would deliver. They're just saying, oh, I changed my mind. Sorry, I want a refund. Or, um, or they make up some reason, you know, to, to get a refund. What really annoys me though about that process is that when they get the refund, they've already received the download. They already have my product on their computer. So they've just effectively stolen from me. Now I'm not talking about people who legitimately want a refund, who, you know, for some reason, you know, they have a legitimate reason for the refund. I'm talking about people who, what we call serial refunders. People who buy a course to get it. Once they get it in their hot little hands, they refund it. They're basically stealing from you. Uh, here's what I love about Fedora. You can cut them off. Okay, because the course is only available in your online school, when somebody refunds your course, you can go into your Fedora back office, find that person, and delete them out of your school. Basically, expel them from your school. Isn't that awesome? So now when somebody refunds, they don't have access to your product anymore. You've cut them off. They don't have your product downloaded on their computer. They, are, they weren't able to steal from you. Yes, they might have had a chance to look at it for a while or maybe take notes or whatever, but they can't download your, your course. So that is a huge, huge benefit. And one of the biggest reasons I loved Fedora is because now, from now on, every WSO that I create will be fulfilled through Fedora. Here's another thing. What if somebody gets access to the Fedora school and then give somebody else that same access or give somebody else a free coupon to access your your online course well if you've created let's say 50 coupons and somebody's handing out those free coupons to other people that didn't actually buy you'll know that these these persons didn't buy and you'll know to be able to delete them expel them from your school very, very powerful and puts you in the driver's seat with your online school. Next, you can bundle courses into one mega bundle and sell for more money. So if you wanted to do just a one-time buy, you could create a mega bundle of themed courses and sell them for $147, $297, $597. You know, it just depends on the, the value that you're giving people. Next, you have a lot more control as compared to Udemy because you decide how long or how short your videos are going to be. You have nobody really overseeing or supervising your course as far as whether it should be a certain way or should be formatted a certain way or anything like that. Basically, you're in full control of your course content and you're in full control as well of your of your students and of your ability to communicate with students because you can email your students 
without restriction, whereas Udemy has certain restrictions on how many times you can email your students. And you don't have the time limits required on Udemy courses. I just, as I just mentioned, Udemy requires that your videos be at least two minutes long, but not more than 20 minutes long. Well, what if you have a one-hour webinar you know, that you want to deliver? You can't do that on Udemy unless you chop it up into three segments, right? Sometimes that doesn't flow. With Fedora, you can upload that one-hour video no problem. There are no such restrictions. And finally, you have a super flexible system for any internet marketer. Let me tell you, this is going to revolutionize the internet marketing world, and you are at the forefront of it. Congratulate yourself. This is awesome.